Hey there, want to learn a trading strategy that only takes 10 minutes a day and can triple your account in a year? Let's dive in. Have you ever wondered how to make trading work when you have a full-time job? It seems like 99% of the strategy you find on YouTube are made for students or people who work from home. They require you to monitor charts for 2-4 to four hours a day to become consistently profitable. It's frustrating, right? Most of us have jobs, how can you expect to escape the rat race if the strategies demand time you don't have? Well, that's exactly why I developed this daily income generator strategy. With this strategy, you can become profitable with little time and potentially triple your account in a year. Using it, we have doubled our account in 4 months from February to May 2024. The results can be found on my website with the account statements and on the Telegram channel where I publish the trades for free. Let's get started. Hello everyone, I'm Damien Levy, an experienced trader and EFT therapist. I'm dedicated to creating content that helps traders become consistent in their trading. If this sounds like it can help you, make sure to subscribe. I have included the setup of this strategy for MetaTrader 4, 5 and TradingView to satisfy most of you. This strategy revolves around three key elements. First, following higher time frame trends. The higher the time frame, the more reliable it is because the biggest investors use those time frames to decide on investing large sums of money. Second, taking trades at high probability support and resistance levels. I will show you a simple and easy way to place these levels that no one talks about. Third, daily candlestick formation for entry confirmation. This is one of the most reliable tools to enter a trade. And as a bonus, I will show you as well how to automate the process at the end of this video. First, weekly chart analysis and trend. We start with the weekly chart to understand the overall trend. When the price moves in one direction, it usually continues for a while before reversing. So by following the trend, we increase our odds of a successful trade. What is the trend? If the price makes higher highs and higher lows, it's called an uptrend. Conversely, if it makes lower lows and lower highs, it's a downtrend. On paper, it seems simple. But on a real chart, identifying the trend can be confusing. Let's look at this real chart on Euro USD. Check the high. Which one would you choose? This one? This one? This one? Oh, maybe this one. And for the low, would you take this low? This low? This low? Or maybe this one? Or this one? See, on a real chart, it's very difficult to find the right highs and lows. To simplify the process of trend identification, I use the Fractal Indicator by Bill Williams. Don't worry, I got you covered. I'll show you how to install everything on MetaTrader 4, 5 and TradingView at the end. So on my chart, you will see small triangles, arrows, indicating turning points defined by this indicator. It works this way. A turning point occurs when a candle has two higher highs before and after it. To clearly see your trend, draw lines from the triangle. If price is breaking highs, you are in an uptrend. If price is breaking lows, you are in a downtrend. No need to be perfect here. So to summarize, identify each turning point using the triangles or arrows. Connect this point to define the trend on the weekly chart. If the price breaks a recent high, we confirm an uptrend and the opposite for a downtrend. Following the weekly trend gives us higher probabilities for successful trades. Next, we place high probability horizontal levels where we expect the price to bounce and resume the trend. These are called support if they are below the price and resistance if they are above the price. Here is another challenge. Look at this chart. Which one would you choose? This one? This one? This one maybe at the extreme. Or this one, maybe lower. What about this one in the middle? Or this one at the bottom? Placing those levels can be compared to an art and it can be very subjective. 
That's why I search for a simple way that will remove doubts from this and also permit a large majority of people to place those levels easily with accuracy. To make this simple, I use the volume at price indicator. This tool shows the volume traded at different price level, indicating zones where the price usually bounces off. You can download it for free from the link below the video. We look for dips in volume at specific price levels to identify zones where the price typically bounces. This helps us increase the odds in favor of our trades. Let's place an horizontal line or two for the zone or level and we need to choose a clean dip or valley, something significant. And now let's check the historical data about those levels so you can see their power. We can see here that the level on top and the level on the bottom which are from minor valley in the volume at price, reject the price, they do, but it's not very strong. Whereas the level in the middle, which is from a strong valley, reject the price two to three times more. See as well here, I place the two level on the major valley. And look at that. Price reject one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight times. And between it breaks, there is a lot of rejections happening, which means the probability are higher for you to get a reversal at this level than the other ones with little value only. That's how we find high probability rejection levels, where we expect a reversal in price. A quick checkpoint. Place one or more levels below the current price in an uptrend and above in a downtrend within the last swing. By the way, if you want me to help you reach financial freedom with trading, I leave a link below that explains it all. With higher probabilities from the trend and the strong support and resistance level, we go now to the daily chart. We wait for the price to touch our level and look for a candlestick confirmation such as an engulfing candle or a pin bar. A bullish engulfing candle engulfs the previous day's low and closes above the high of the previous day. A bearish engulfing candle engulfs the previous day's high and closes below the low of the previous day. For the pin bar, a bullish pin bar has a wick that's 55% of the total candle height at the bottom of it for a bullish one and indicates price rejecting the bottom side. A bearish pin bar shows a rejection weak of 55% as well of the total height and this time on the upside. Once spotted, we use Fibonacci retracement to measure the weak on the one hour time frame. To check the size of the week, use a FIBO retracement and set a level at 0.55. So you will know if the candle has a 55% weak size or not. To place the FIBO retracement, mark your daily candle with a vertical line, move to the one hour chart and place the period separator using Ctrl Y. Now the candles after your vertical line represent your daily candle. Place your FIB retracement from the top to bottom for a bearish pin bar and opposite for a bullish one. And you can then check the size of the week by looking where the price has closed the day. Let's look at an example. We are in a weekly uptrend and place a support level below the price using the volume at price. On the daily chart, we wait for the price touching the level and a bullish engulfing or pin bar candle at this level. In a downtrend, on the last swing, there was this nice valley. It's a strong level. We go on the daily and on the daily in the zone, it's forecast. This will happen this week. We wait for a pin bar or an engulfing going down. Trade execution. Identify the pin bar or angle fee candle, place a vertical line at the candle start if it's a pin bar, switch to the one hour chart, verify the candle's weak percentage using Fibonacci retracement, and then here's the entry, conservative one. Place the entry at the market price at the end of this candle. You need to wait for the candle to close. If you want an entry that will give more risk to reward ratio, you can eventually enter at 48.5% retracement. And the stop loss will be slightly uh, below the low if the day is for a buy and above the high if the day is for a sell. To give you more example, I take this example of this pin bar in a bearish downtrend. The first entry is at the end of the candle right here. And then I place the Fibonacci retracement from top to bottom in this example. And the second entry retracement is here. For this bearish angle thing, the first entry is at the bottom of the candle right here. 
and then the same Fibonacci retracement 48.5% and then the second entry is at retracement. For this example of a bullish engulfing, qualify, first entry at the end of the bullish engulfing and then Fibonacci 48.5 retracement, second entry in the middle. This pin bar, bullish pin bar, entry at the end of the candle and second entry at 48.5 retracement entry. I didn't say, but I use 48.5% retracement on the Fibonacci and not 50 because most of the time price will reverse just before the 50% retracement of the candle. So 48.5 was tested and works pretty fine, sometimes to the pip. The target profit conservative use one times the size of the candles for the target profit for both entry. Long-term target profit, you can eventually use the previous high for an uptrend and the previous low for a downtrend from the weekly chart. If you like this video so far, please give me feedback so I know what type of content you enjoy the most and I'll create more of it. Your feedback also helps me to grow my channel. Risk management. I advise you to risk 0.5% per trade on a prop firm challenge and up to 1% per trade on a personal account. Limit trades to be a maximum of two per currency to manage risk on your account effectively. By the way, you can tell me in the comment what trading platform you use. This way I will adapt my content on the next video. Thanks. Setting up your chart. To make the process of setting up this strategy simple, I have created a template for MetaTrader 4 and 5 and I have packaged the indicators necessary for those platforms and you can download the file, the link is below this video. Once you have unzipped the file, you will find three folders with a PDF explaining everything. But to summarize, the first folder is for the trading journal that can help you to improve your own trading and reprogram your mind. The second folder is for risk management smart tools. There is a position size calculator for MetaTrader 4 or 5 and TradingView with other nice tools to help to control your risk and protect your account. The third folder is the folder we want to look into today. It is for setting up easily on your chart this strategy. So open this folder. Inside, there is two folders, one for MetaTrader 4 and one for MetaTrader 5. We will start with MetaTrader 4 click on it, you will see there is an indicator folder and a template folder. Go to indicators and select all of the indicators that are inside. Right click, copy them, then come back to your MetaTrader 4. Go to file, open data folder, then go into MQL4, then go into indicators and then right click here and paste all the indicators there. Now we will take care of the template. So come back to the original folder, go back to template form MT4 and go to the template folder here. Select the template, copy it, go back to MetaTrader 4, file, open data folder and then select the template folder. Paste it there, bare. Now your template is installed for MetaTrader 4. You restart your platform and then you go back into template right here and you select daily income generator, my friendly trader. And this will automatically place on your chart all the indicator necessary with the right parameters. You should see the fractal here and the volume at price on the weekly chart only ready to analyze the chart. That's it. Now let's take care of MetaTrader 5. You go to template for MetaTrader 5, then indicators, same process, select all the indicators. Then you go into your MetaTrader 5 platform go into file, open data folder, MQL5 and indicators folder. Then right click and you paste all the indicators there. Go back to the original folder to get the template now. You go in the folder named MQL5 profile template. Get the template, copy it, go back to your MetaTrader 5, file, open data folder. This is different than MetaTrader 4 here. You go into MQL5 profiles, templates and there you right click and you paste it there. After that you restart your MetaTrader 5, you go into template and here you find the daily income generator from my Frenchy Trader. Click on it, then you go to the weekly chart, you will see the volume at price appear. It's different than MetaTrader 4 here again. You have two vertical lines. 
the red one you put it where is the price right now and the second one the blue one you place it in the range that you want to analyze to get the profile and the strongest level of support and resistance. Once you do that, you will see the volume at price adapting itself and it will tell you with the strong valleys where are the strongest level of support and resistance. Now let's go to trading view. Select a pair, I put for the example Euro USD here. Then I go into indicators and I type fractals. You will see Williams fractals, that's the most common, click on it. I select here the time frame to the weekly chart because that's where you analyze the chart. Here you go to one week and then on the left here into forecasting and measurement tools, you go on the arrow on the right and you will see fixed range volume profile. This works the same as in MetaTrader 5. You will then need to left click where is the price right now and then you will go on the left and you will make a second click where you see how many candles you want to analyze and this will give you on the left side this time the volume at price with the valley and everything. I usually advise to use 200 to 500 candles as historical data for the volume at price. Now your template is ready. You can see there is a fractals telling you which are the turning points for your trend and you can find your juicy levels with the volume at price. Note that if the horizontal candles of the volume at price are too big, you can right click and go into the properties of this tool and then change the size of the candle by increasing their numbers. You are all set up, ready to master this strategy. Here is the bonus of the video. I have even created a robot that will take the trade automatically once you have placed your levels. Contact me on Telegram if you're interested. Now that you know how to apply the daily income generator strategy, check out my next video where I show you how to use the position sizers, three different tools to place the trade and calculate your size in two seconds. It is for all platforms and will help you place your trade effortlessly. Respecting a fixed percentage of your account at risk per trade, it's an essential tool to protect your money.